You say you don't think it's inspiring. What do you feel like is lacking in inspiration? Like, does it inspire you, or are you worried it's not oh, going to inspire Oh, it inspires kids? me, but I feel like it's just, like, Emily said, like, bullet did this, like, last year I had, like, a quote on top, and, mm-hmm. like, um, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Um, it's inspiring to me, like, but it's um, not, like, I guess, like, I didn't do, like, a lot of writing and explaining it. It's just everything is bulleted. Mm-hmm. It's, But it is inspiring to me. I guess my one regret last year was that I just didn't feel, I felt like they mastered the content pretty well, but they didn't really, their social studies skills didn't improve as much as I would want. So, um, I, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, just like thinking, like, do you have any, and it's like really hard to put into words, but like, do you have any way of, or sort of vision of how you want them to interact with the content? Because I don't know, like, people generally learn it better if they're more invested in like learning. Like, so how do you get them, like, excited? You know, like, I don't know if that would be a goal or your approach, but, like... In learning the content? Yeah, like, how do you make, like... I mean, I guess, I don't know, like, the part I, like, interesting to, like, these kids. I think, like, um... <laughs> you'll learn, like, that's the... That one's easier one. I was thinking World War One, <laughs> yeah. which would be, like, the harder one. That's well, awesome. They get to make trenches. Yeah. Very, you know. yeah. Um... To be honest, I feel like I didn't have, like, one of the things that I could do okay was get them invested in, like, what they were learning in social studies, just because we have amazing smart boards, and you can do, like, pictures, and you can do media, um, and then, like, through, like, different lessons, getting them invested, where I, and maybe you have some suggestions, how to get them invested in reading, like, a primary source from 18... 92 like that where it's just they're getting frustrated because the wording is different and it's from England and they don't know and like Z's and S's uh, are confusing and like stuff like that um that's where I guess I would I would say like get them excited about that uh, like handstands and running around the room saying it's awesome but I um that's where that's where I would probably I think I did it a couple times at the beginning of the year, and I'm like, wow, yesterday we did like a fun, cool game type thing where they learned history. Today they read a primary source that went horribly. Let's go back to like two days ago, but at the same time, like they can't read primary sources. And then, like, jump to May, they can't read primary sources. So, um, yeah, I guess I'll have to think about like how to make reading fun. Museum has a lot of primary sources. Hmm? Zuni Museum, and they're like from their grandparents and great grandparents. And like U.S. That's cool. and like Zuni history, or it's like Zuni history, but a lot of it's also like yes. you could you they they have them all like digitized, so you can go through them and see like could I incorporate some of these mm-hmm. or not? And a lot of them yeah. are reports, and like there's elementary school through high school. Maybe they would be more motivated to read it if it was like. Possibly. They read the con- Zuni Constitution, and that was, like, a bit of kicking and screaming, but they, like, I could see a little bit more, obviously, like, cultural relevance is more Well, even if you're just thing. using it to teach the skills of how you analyze the primary analyze source, like, it, it's not yeah, even related to your content, but, you know, okay, yeah, like, this is something idea. juicy you're going to be excited to read. It's from someone you know or is related to you. Let me teach you the skills, and then we'll apply them to, like, yeah. the more dry stuff. Yeah, it's just like, yeah, just true. maybe just like getting the skills down. That would be good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm starting with, even starting with like contemporary sources. Like, contemporary primary sources are readable. They might be like a little bit higher than what they're used to reading, but then being like, okay, it's the same animal, like just different weird looking letters. Like, we can do this. Like, yeah. I'm sort of taking it. Yeah, those like little increments. Yeah, always kind of interesting things. Things that like juniors find much 